look, there's a risk with any technology that's made with insufficient user input, with insufficient contextual consideration of user input to be uh, unhelpful, to be not usable, uh, to frustrate people, to cause dissatisfaction, to contribute to errors. Um, so that, that premise, that underlying principle of involving end users in what you want your AI to do um, is critical to making sure that when you come out the under, other end of the development pipeline that you've actually produced a product that's not only technically safe and helpful in terms of say clinical outcomes but actually works with the workflow of the clinician in the particular kind of setting and that could even come down to is this a clinician who spends most of the day in the operating theatre or is this a clinician who spends most of the day in an outpatient clinic type setting the needs in those two settings from a workflow perspective are very different.